Hey, uh, Brewster Slicer has some new features that are in a preview build on GitHub. And one of them is particularly interesting. That feature is organic support structures. Isn't that incredible? To enable it, you just need to download the latest alpha software build. Uh, we'll search for Prusa Slicer GitHub. Have a, have a look at the uh, Prusa Slicer page. Go over to the releases, click that. Then grab the whichever the latest alpha is here. You can try alpha three, I'm on alpha two. Scroll down all the way to the bottom and uh, just grab whichever image you need for your particular operating system. So once you've downloaded it, open it up, uh, install it, open it up and go over to support material. Make sure you've got generate supports enabled and set the style to organic. So uh, just to give you an idea of what the difference is, that's the, I'll switch it over to grid, generate slices and we'll see how, how much different it is. So there you go. Uh, took a little bit longer to do this as well. As you can see, there's far more material being used and it takes longer to print. It's going to be a massive improvement when this comes to 3D printing from the handful of tests. I can, I can see it's uh, going to be a real, really, really useful feature going forward. Looking forward to using it more. Cheers.